You like how I worded that? I love it. I love it. I want my turn. I want my turn to rip our muscle tissue. Okay. What am I thinking? What did I learn? Put my hand flat. Wrap my thumb a tiny bit. Put my other hand down. Make sure I walk over my hands. Bend my legs. Ooh. <laughs> okay. Almost went lightheaded on the very first rep. It is. And just like with any exercise, my friends, I say that to you, and I mean it as hard as you want it to be. Am I flexing this arm as I can? Am I going down as slow as I can? Is everything engaged? One. Then I. I will say I screwed this up. My left is my weaker. It's a fat joke. I'm in my off season. Thank you. Right. Trying to put on some mass. It doesn't get here unless you earn it. Three more. Those are as hard as you want them to be. I still my client yesterday. So symbolic. Many guys will argue me, but I don't give a crap. I don't care. Calves, abs, and biceps are the three muscle groups that you can guarantee this theory to be true. The rest of them, Sometimes they get so pumped you lose that burn, but the other three, no. I want you to imagine your hand and a lighter underneath your hand, and that flame is one inch away from your hand. Well, that's your training calves, abs, and biceps. The longer you can hold that flame underneath your hand, the longer you can take that pain, the longer you can will yourself to stay in that position that hurts like hell, the faster those muscle groups will grow the faster you will see results. Like I said, it doesn't work with all the other ones. But in that theory, that theory alone, when you sit down to train those muscle groups, remember that, lighter under the hand. 